Hello everyone, it is Katrina here from Inspo & Co. And I am so excited because today I am doing a giant Gwenny B haul. Yay! So if you're not familiar how Gwenny B works, it's a clothing rental company. And so it kind of works like Rent the Runway. Um, but the thing that sets them apart is they only do clothing for girls who are size 10 and above. And so it's considered a plus size um, rental service. Uh, so for my plan, let's say for example, um, I pay a certain amount per month and then I'm able to have four items out at a time. So Gwenny B has an app and they also have a website where they're, they can show you consistently what's coming into like their, their shop or the clothing that you're allowed to choose from. And they always have new things coming up. I probably get a notification once a week that there's like a new collection or new items that are posted on the web. So I can go to that page and I can click on a dress. They have shirts, they have pants, they have jackets. Um, if I find something that I want to try, and they will show me what sizes it comes in. They also have a measurement sheet. So if you're not sure your size, um, you can like actually get your measurements and see how you would best fit into that garment. And then people can also review the garment and say it runs small or it runs whatever so that you have an accurate depiction of what you want to get. And if I want to get that item sent to me, I select my size and I put it in my closet. And then what ends up happening is I can't choose what items from my closet come to me. So I only fill my closet with items that I know that I want. And if there's something that I really, really want to get sent to me, they also have an option to make something your top priority. So you can click and put certain items like saying that you want to get them first if possible. So then Gwenny B will choose up to four items for my plan. There are plans where you can get just one item a month or where you can get unlimited items a month. It really depends how often you're going to be needing clothes and maybe what your job is and how much you're into fashion. You can choose all these different things, right? But in my plan, I only have four items. So they will select four items from my closet. It's a surprise. I don't get to choose exactly which items. And they send them to me to wear. And they will, they have really great shipping. They let me know when items are coming. There's a tracking number and you get an email telling you that these items are on their way. Once they get to me, I can wear them for months. I can wear them for two days just to work. I mean, it really doesn't matter. Um, but when I'm done wearing the item, there's a little bag that they come shipped with that you just pop them into the bag, you seal the bag up, and you put it in your mailbox to get picked up by the mailman, and then they send you your next four items. So it's really, really easy. It's really, really hassle-free. I've gotten into a really great system now so that I consistently have items going in and out. So literally, as I'm about to send my items in, my next four items um, are coming to me. So I always have a steady stream of really great fashion um, and really cool items that I can wear whenever. Um, you can also choose to buy items if you like. So if you're really you're wearing some vest or whatever and you really, really love it, you can select a button and they will just bill the same card that they bill you monthly on for that item and then you get to keep that item. It's a very long explanation for what is about to happen. So, Gwenny B also has a shop. And in that shop, you can purchase um, brand new items or you can purchase older items. So maybe items that were like last month's um, new additions. Once people rent them out a bunch and they wear them, then they just have these, these clothes and so they usually put them on really steep clearance for you to actually purchase and keep so that they can bring in new items. And I'm telling you, it's not like steep clearance like a million people have worn this and this item is garbage now. They dry clean and hand wash and I mean they take very good care of their clothes and if an item doesn't meet a specific standard they don't send that item out and so what ends up happening is they have the Gwenny B shop and about once every three months it gets so full of old stock that's really not even like old, right? It's like two months old maybe, um, that they need to clear out so that they can put new items into the rotation to have rented. Um, and so you are able to buy 
really expensive. I'm talking like $150 a dress expensive, name brand clothes for nothing because it really is just advantageous for them to sell it so that they have room for new stuff that can get rented out. And that's the predicament that I'm currently in. They recently had a 30% off all their clearance sale or everything in their, um, their shop to sell. And I went crazy. I found so many dresses that I absolutely loved and fall is coming, fall is here. And I was like, again, shopping and on a kick. I ended up getting, uh, not one, uh, not two, but three giant boxes. I mean, these are like heavy from Gwenny B that I purchased. I think I got 12 different items for a total of $140 for the 12 items. Some of these dresses were $140 for the original dress, and they were on sale for $9 and $12 a dress. Yeah. And these dresses also are items that you can't find easily in stores. And I'm going to be honest, like people are always asking me, where did you get that? Or how did you, I don't know where I would get it if it wasn't for Gwenny B because they find like the coolest plus size fashion and they put it all in one place. And then they're like, yeah, we need to get new stuff. So this dress is like $7. I know this is I they don't pay me to say this I am just obsessed with Gwenny B plain and simple I've never had a problem with them really great customer service and high quality clothes yay so after all this explanation it's gonna be a pretty long video um, I would like to show you the haul of what I end up getting from Gwenny B I'm being very careful the scissors here because I don't want to lose a finger or a hand. Yikes. Okay, right off the bat, I love this dress. This dress is from the brand Julian Taylor. It's a size 14 and it is super cute. So it's playing on that sort of color block trend. It's got this nice little color block top. And then it goes down into a sort of A-line skirt. And I've worn Julian Taylor dresses before, and I like them cut a little bit um, larger on me, and that's why I got the 14. So it's a nice, stretchy, but sturdy fabric. And I believe that this dress cost me $9. So uh, yeah, the original dress price was not $9, I can guarantee you that. Um, but this is just like really, really cute and I cannot wait to wear it with some boots and some tights. It's going to look great this fall. Okay. The second thing is a dress from the brand Lucy Lou. And I think I also got this in a 14. Oh, it's in a one X. So it's kind of like, doesn't really have a size, but okay. So this is super cute. Um, it has a low cut neckline. So you could actually put a little pin in there if you're concerned about modesty. Nice quarter length sleeves, and then it cinches in at the waist and then flares out for this really cute sort of hourglass effect that I love. And I actually have a crinoline that I wear under dresses like this a lot. So to make the bottom part stand out even more. So I believe that this dress was $12.00 on sale and it was originally like $85. So that is a really great deal. Okay, now this is a dress that I actually um, got to just try on to wear that I actually rented and then I ended up wearing it and loved it so much. So I'm glad that they had it in the sale. So it's a size 14, it's the brand London Times. Um, it, it's fit is really, really cute. So it's sleeveless, it's very sort of springy, it has all these little ruffles, which is kind of creating a sort of camouflaging um, effect if there's any like, you know, bulges or rolls. And then it goes down to about mid hip, 
where it flares out into this really nice flowy fabric. Um, I absolutely love this dress. It fit me really, really well. And I cannot wait to wear this too. This is another one of those dresses that I rented from Gwenny B and absolutely loved and I was so glad that it was on sale. So it's also from London Times, um, but it is so cute. Um, it has a nice little V for the neckline and then it almost looks like it's a faux wrap dress because it has this little band of fabric that comes around with these sort of see-through quarter, not, not quarter, but see-through long sleeves. And then it hugs your curves around the waist with some draping and then goes down into a more sort of curvaceous, curve-hugging bottom. Um, I look killer in this dress. And one of the reasons is because of all this detailing on the waist. So it kind of like um, wraps and the fabric swaths around your waistline really great. And so this is a perfect dress to flatter those killer curves. Okay, for our next item, this is more of like a basic, and I think it was one of the cheaper items. I think it was like $7. It's a very sort of comfy jersey knit dress. This is in size medium, and it's from Juno Rose, which I'd never heard of that brand or had rented this dress, so I'm glad that I got to try it. Um, it is also very figure figure friendly because it has a lower sort of neckline that crisscrosses and then it cinches at the waist. Um, again, I said it's more of like a t-shirt dress and it has this really light floral pattern on it that's really adorable. And then it has these two ties um, up at the neck. So you could either tie it in front of your neck or you could tie it behind your neck. And I actually really like dresses like this. Um, while I don't think they're meant to be kind of versatile, I like to wear them in different ways. So Maybe if I wanted a sort of higher neck occasion to showcase a certain scarf or neckline, I would wear it this way. And then if I was going out and wanted something a little more like Mavo Boom, I would wear it this way so that that draping was down the front. And then finally, the last thing in this first box of sale items that I purchased is this really cute dress. So this is from um, Triste. Is it Trist? Trist. I, I've tried a lot of um, dresses from this brand and I really, really like it, if I can pronounce it correctly. So this is a 1X and again, it's very um, friendly, body skimming fabric. It's quarter length sleeves, it cinches at the waist a little bit, and then it flares out into a sort of A-line skirt. So it is really, really adorable and will be great, again, like I said, with maybe a belt at the waist and um, some boots and some tights for the fall kind of funky color pattern and I don't think I would have normally gotten it if it wasn't the fact that it was seven dollars but I know that this cut looks really great on me and so I thought well why not even if I wear it a few times it'll have paid for itself. This is another one that I actually rented and then I ended up seeing it on the sale and was like I have to have it. I wore this dress to um, create and cultivate when it's a giant um, convention for women who work in the digital space and entrepreneurs and it was super fun and I got a lot of compliments on my dress while I was there. So this cut looks amazing on me. It's a stretchier, thicker fabric with short sleeves but it's a really fun and creative sort of watercolor print pattern and then it kind of just goes straight down but it's lined so it's not like you're going to see any sort of um, bumps or rolls or like weird things um, and I love this dress. This is another one that I also had worn and then saw and then said I was gonna get. So it's from the brand City Chic. And I, I kind of joke, but it reminds me of like my airline pilot dress. So, or like stewardess kind of. It's kind of got this retro mod futuristic look to it. A little keyhole cut out here in the front so it's sexy without showing a lot. Um, and then it kind of just goes straight down but with this blue paneling in the front and it fits very well. It goes away from the body where it should and it hugs the places that it shouldn't. Everyone's gotten those sort of dresses that look comfy and then come to find out they're like wearing a giant sack. And so if you don't cinch them, cinch them in, you look 
very bizarre. It just looks like you're hiding your body. And the thing that I love about City Chic is whenever they, I've worn dresses from them that are more of like those straight down dresses, they don't do that. They actually hug your curves where they're supposed to hug them and go away from your curves where they're supposed to. So I was really excited to pick up this little dress. And then finally, my last two pieces are two things that I haven't tried. This is from the brand Taylor Woman and it's a 1X and it's just a simple sweater dress but it has a really great A-line and that's the reason that I picked it up. So it's it's a little light, more lightweight of a knit. It's got these little sort of cut off sleeves that aren't capped. Cap sleeves really don't look great on anyone. And then it's got this sort of really nice knit pattern that's small and then goes into a little bit larger um, just for that sort of great visual effect. And then my very last piece was a shirt. And a lot of times if I'm going to get something from Gwenny B, the thing that I like is, I've tried their pants a few times and a couple of their shirts, but I like that their dresses are so high quality that it's literally a full outfit. You can just pop it on. But this shirt was so cheap. It was like $7.50. And I was like, you know what, why not? It's one size from the brand Moda Mix. And again, it's in floral, so of course I love it. Um, it's a little, it looks like it's a little bit more of a crop top, but based on the model um, that they had on the site, it looks like it'll hit right above the line of a high rise pair of jeans, which is perfect to draw your eye into that center line. And then it has these nice little leather pleather detailings on um, to keep it kind of like in trend and in season and a nice little exposed zipper on the back. So I am really excited um, for this shirt. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you haven't um, subscribed to Gwenny B, you should really check them out, especially if you're size 10 or above, um, because they have a great selection and really great service. And I will be linking um, a bunch of these products that I purchased below, if they still are up on their website, as well as the difference between what they originally cost and what I paid for them, because a part of shopping online that I love is being able to get great deals and this sale really was a really great deal so thanks again for watching and i will definitely oh, just be here enjoying all of these things and i'll see you uh in my next video bye mm.